Hey guys, it's me, Monica. I am coming to you vlog style. Hopefully I'm speaking loud enough where you guys can hear me in the camera or in the microphone rather. Um, I'm doing my six week update BSG. I'm headed to class right now. I have some protein coffee right here that I am working with this morning. Um, let's see. Starting off with statistics or stats. <laughs> um, had surgery on 6'6 six, six with Alabama Weight Loss Group, Dr. Lee Smith um, in Birmingham, Alabama. Highest weight recorded was 342, maybe. I gotta go back and look. Um, surgery weight was 3. 26 current weight 305 total loss I'm not good at math in my head so we're just gonna say 30 pounds how about that <laughs> we're gonna say a good 30 pounds gone Woohoo! yes so how have I been feeling I've been feeling pretty good um lots of energy um lots and lots and lots of energy um just been dealing with um, I'm back in grad school I think I said that in my previous video back in grad school um, what else um, this is the last official week of class and finals are next week which I have projects for my finals so I'm really not stressed I am I'm lying I'm stressed stressed the heck out about it um, so I got, some, I got my weekend is full Work, 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 work. Trying to get this stuff done. Um, let's see, I have a presentation today. What else has been going on? Oh, um, my oldest has food poisoning. So she's with my mother-in-law right now. Um, the day I'm filming this, which is what? July 18th, I'm six weeks post-op. So I just want to make that clear that I'm six weeks post-op on today, Wednesday. Um, hopefully you guys cannot hear my air conditioner. It's hot here in Alabama. My um, temp thing says 88, but I know that's a lie. It's, it's hotter than it. It's so much hotter than it. Um, I was going to try to do this update um, with my regular camera. But I was like, you know what? This is life. BSG is my life right now. Well, forever. Um, so I'm going to um, I'm going to do it like this. And I, I may come every once in a while and do um, a sit down in front of the camera video, like an in depth video. Um, I'm sorry, I'm passing an 18 wheeler. Um, an in depth video regarding BSG um, that'll be where I actually sit down in front of the camera and answer questions that have been asked of me of regarding my BSG experience peace out there's some state troopers up ahead <laughs> won't catch Monica speeding <laughs> um, I can start to see like my collarbone and stuff yes I know I have on the same shirt that was in the last video but this morning I was trying to get my daughter to my mother-in-law's house I just throwed on something that don't don't worry it's clean it's clean but I just you know whatever today is a chill day I'm, I'm tired I've been up for a couple of days dealing with her vomiting and whatnot um, trying to get all my work done so you know hey I got on my shades. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, what else? Um, I go for my three month of three month follow up in September. So I'm hoping to lose between now and then another 30 pounds. Um, I haven't been able to work out this week due to my hectic schedule, class schedule, and with Olivia being sick, trying to make sure she's okay. So I haven't been able to work out. Um, I only have one class today. 
Um, my drive is an hour and 45 minutes, so hopefully I'll be back in time after Bible study. I can go hit the track. I'll probably just be dressed for, um, you know, going working out. When I um, leave Bible study, I can, we'll just take separate cars and I can just go ahead and go to the track and do what I need to do as far as um, working out today. If not, um, I'll be hitting the gym later. But right now, I kind of prefer the track. I want to be outside where the sun is beaming on me, where I can sweat more. You know, sweat is your back crying. I want this mug to cry. Oh, I, I want this mug to hurt like I've been hurting the last 39 years. I want all my fat to hurt like I've been hurting these last 39 years because I've cried enough over being overweight. I've finally taken that step and said no more. So fat, cry yourself away. Cry, 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 cry. Um, what else? Mm, I'm actually going to try to measure myself this weekend, which I, that's something I didn't think about doing before I had the surgery so I can keep up with my measurements. So I'm doing that this weekend. So we're just going to, you know, start from this point. Um, I'll weigh myself Saturday morning and um, do my biceps, triceps, all that glutes, whatever else you need to do. Well, glutes with your butt. <laughs> Hips, waist, all that other stuff. Um, trying to get measured this weekend. What else? Um, so somewhere in a future video, you'll see me, I, instead of me spouting off stats, I'll have them somewhere listed, like off on, to, off on the side or something. Um, so you won't have to constantly hear me repeat. What are your stats? What are your stats? Well, there they are. Just scroll back and read them. Um, and I'll try to keep them updated in the um, info bar below. What else? What else should I talk about? It's hot. <laughs> what was I thinking getting faux locks in this summer heat? I have no idea. But I got them gonna keep them in for probably about another two weeks depending on how good they stay um, my beautician said that my hair texture has gotten softer so I was like hmm is it the biotin that I'm taking or is it the surgery having an effect on my hair type we'll see um, I haven't experienced any hair loss yet um, like I said in my other video my previous video that from my, my understanding that usually comes between three and four months and it is temporary so i'm not really stressed about oh i'm gonna go bald no i'm i'm, I'm not stressed and um you know it's hair it'll grow back you know um that's what they make wigs for so you may see your girl rocking a wig and this wood thing sorry it was telling me i had um low battery life so i'm gonna try to wrap this up and get off of here um but yeah that's my six week update um oh i'm on regular foods i'm i'm off of the semi-regular diet i've gone through all phases of my diet which was liquid full liquid soft slash puree foods semi-regular and now i'm on a regular diet um my protein coffee is a cold brew coffee that i get out of the dairy section and a premier protein caramel protein shake. This is everything to me. Because I, I don't know what it is. Me and protein shakes, the, the mental thing about it with me, I, mm -mm, nope. So I have to find other ways to get my protein in. Um, one day I made a banana chocolate smoothie. Oh my gosh. And then when I talked to my nutritionist, she was like, you may want to stay away from fruit because it's nature's sugar. Although it's a good sugar, you could have too much of it. And I was like, really? But I'm going to drink this shake today. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, another thing, I'm kind of bloated. Aunt, Aunt Flo decided she wanted to come and take a, make, make a visit. So, screw you, Aunt Flo. You're messing up my progress. 
so I see like a little water retention going on with me because of ant flow. It's okay, ant flow. I got your number. I got your number. Y'all don't come for me because I'm drinking out of a straw. I'm driving. So I really can't see myself turning up coffee right now. It's not hot, but still. I can't see myself doing that. Um, I did eat some Zaxby's chicken yesterday. I, the mental me is going, oh, you can have all of that. So I ordered what they call the wings and things, which is five wings and three chicken strips. Three chicken wings was all I ate. They were bone-in wings, traditional bone-in wings. I ate three of those and it was kaput. No more. Nothing. Nada. Zilch. Zero. Zero. Nothing. It was, it was a done dollar. I do follow the 30 minute rule. Drinking 30 minutes before you eat and drinking 30 minutes after. Um, I'm not a huge breakfast person. Thus, that's why I do the protein coffee in the mornings. Yeah, I'm kind of late on it. It's about 11.42, but I had some stuff trying to get Olivia situated because she was sick. Or because she is sick. I had to go talk to her band director because band camp is going on this week. Hey, y'all, I need y'all to watch these videos. Olivia's a senior. <laughs> and these senior fees are killing me. <laughs> we're doing cabin gat world. We're doing regular senior portraits. We're doing the drape pictures. If you remember from high school where the guys dressed up in um, suit and tie and the females had the little black um, v-neck thing that's called the drape picture um, for band we've got to do senior pictures for that her senior banner for band her senior banner for soccer um, yearbook um, cap and gown fees um, just and that's on top of regular band fees for this year um, when I go pick up her schedule um, in two weeks I have to pay fees for that so I'm like so I need y'all to watch my videos I need to watch ours I need to be monetized <laughs> and I am just keeping it real with y'all these fees are gonna kill me this year oh my goodness and it's it's a lot it's a lot it's a lot and then she wants a car mama's working baby mama is working on you a car so I'm gonna get off here and charge up my phone because the 20% light just came on or the 20% warning came on earlier and it's like, okay, I don't have that much time. So again, this is my six week checkup or six week update. I'm gonna try to bring you these once a week. They won't, they won't always be in my car. I'm gonna try to avoid that as much as possible, but if they are, it is what it is um, just continue to pray for me I'll pray for you um, yeah that's it that is it big baby so I'm gonna get off here and plug my phone up and concentrate on driving and in the meantime in between time be safe really you just now want to turn on signal light bro like what is your problem Y'all, I have road rage. I, I don't have violent road rage. I have road rage to the point where I talk to people that do stupid stuff on the road in front of me. <laughs> you know, I, I say a little few choice words here and there. And they can't hear me, though. I'm not getting out of my car or anything like that. I know better. But anyway, as I was saying, I'm going to get off here and charge my phone so I can go to class and do my presentation. And come on back to the house. So, in the meantime, in between time, be safe. Be blessed and have a wonderful day. Bye, y'all.